Hello Masaki Universe for Copa America update. I really thought I can wear my Brazil jersey also for this video, but nope. I'm giving my Peru jersey some love since Peru wins. I know you have not seen this in a dedicated video. This is got in Peru at the airport in 2009. So uh, it's a weird jersey, but I actually overall like it a lot. Good memories is attached with Peru. Anyway, let's go to Copa America. The first game was indeed uh, Bolivia against Peru. I only saw the goals and a little bit, you know, scrolling through the game. I didn't really see uh, proper highlights. Um, Peru had the better of the game throughout. I mean, they are overall the better team. However, um, Bolivia gets a penalty after a shot on goal is kind of deflected by uh, Zambrano. Like that hits the hand. Yeah, I think you cannot uh, talk much about uh, that. Was a lengthy re review, but in the end, uh, Martins gets the penalty and gets the lead for Bolivia. And, th and I'm thinking of Peru is again uh, squandering uh, a good performance. But no, Guerrero just before halftime gets a pretty nice goal. I mean, uh, he gets a deep pass. Um, tips it past the goalkeeper and then uh, puts it into the net. Uh, it's 1-1 one, one and a half at the Maracana, where there was some serious empty seats there. Uh, Peru rewards themselves then for uh, having more of the game. Guerrero with the cross in, Farfan heads it in in the 55th, makes it 2-1. And in stoppage time, Flores, uh, after a pass of Farfan, so you see the chain there, um, adds the third, which was interestingly taken as he really, he was cl uh, clear on goal, takes his time, uh, looks out the goalkeeper, meanwhile the defenders catch up, but he from the distance can put it nicely into the net. Peru ran out three more winners, and I thought if Brazil now could beat uh, Venezuela, then Peru really looks well in this group. However, nothing ever so, uh, so easy for Brazil. Brazil dominated against Venezuela, uh, sold out in Salvador, but you know, in Salvador at the World Cup, that was the one game where um, Mexico got a nil-nil against Brazil. Brazil again dominates, dominates, especially in the second half, and you thought they got the breakthrough finally very late in the game um, through Coutinho of all again. However, when you look at the replay, the, ga the goal is taken off by VAR because Firmino just touches it and he was, of course, in offside position. Um, Fernandinho, in the 99th minute, because there were a lot of VAR reviews, gets uh, a header that just streaks by. I think before that, it could have been a penalty given Gabriel Jesus uh, missed chances. I mean, Rondon had one chance in the first half, uh, as I remember from the highlights was not to be. Venezuela is a pesky, pesky, pesky team. They got no points of Peru. They got no points of Brazil. I wonder, uh, you know, in order for them to do a little bit more, they, I mean, they need to beat Bolivia, but they also need to score goals so far. They only went out for nil-nil draw. So I wonder um, if that will play anything. I still would unfortunately expect Brazil to beat Peru. And yep then Peru could well end up in, four, in third place and we don't know where this will be going. At the moment, when we look at the table, Brazil leads uh, this group with four points. Peru also has four points. However, um, the goal conceded against Bolivia puts them just behind Brazil. Venezuela with two points, but you know, with a win, they could uh, safely secure the passage on to the next round. Uh, tonight, are two more games from Group B with Colombia against Qatar and with Argentina against Paraguay. Will Argentina get back on track? We, we have to wait and see. Uh, also looking forward how Colombia will do against Qatar. Uh, whether the Qatar result against Paraguay was just a temporary thing or whether this can be sustained. I mean, Colombia is a different proposition. Anyway. Let me know if you watched any of the games, whether you agree with my assessments of these that I could get from a little bit highlights, a little bit scrolling through the games. Um, give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed this video. Subscribe to my channel if you want to see more of these and I will talk to you soon. Bye. Hey there, I really hope you enjoyed this video. 
and if you did, here are some videos and playlists that might be of interest to you too. Also, please consider subscribing to my channel as it will give you all the updates on my channel, all things My Soccer Universe. And with that, I want to wish you a wonderful day.